Hello, and in this video for how to play Firefight 2nd Edition, we're looking at nerve tests and broken units. Now, off camera, my nightmares here have just had an incredibly successful attack against Matt's enforcers, and they've taken off four of his operatives. So Matt, now what happens? Well, I get to choose which, which of those four uh, I'm going to take off. Now, obviously the leader, as we've said uh, in previous videos, is always the last one to go. Yeah. Um, and I'm going to save my burst laser because uh, I, I quite like its pinning effects. So I, will, I would take off these four guys here. Yeah. Now, at the point that a unit is, has, is down to below 50%, so less than 50% of its starting numbers, yeah. it's broken. So you've okay. got a broken uh, marker next to it. Um, and that, what that means is that in the, uh, the, in the end phase of every round, it has to make a nerve test. Okay. If it fails that nerve test, it flees. Now, that could be a tactical fallback or something else, but it's removed as effectively killed from the game. Okay, so you literally take the unit off, it's, it's gone. It's gone. Right. Yeah. So you lose it for the next round and, and for the rest of the game. Now, enforcers are quite uh, quite good. They've got a nerve of three. So any three or more, and I'm okay. Okay. So it's a 75% chance for, for enforcers. Um, now, there are some modifiers to that. If I'm in a building... It's plus one, so basically it's only on a one that I fail. Okay. It's two up, I'm okay. Um, some models, like commanders, might have the inspiring keyword, again, similar to in Kings of War, yep. although it's only a six-inch range, but that gives you a re-roll to that, uh, any, failed, uh, any failed nerve test. Right. Units that are pinned are minus one, and if, you're, if I'd lost five, I'd have one model left. Once you're the last surviving model of a troop or a specialist unit, that's yeah. another minus two. Okay. So if he's out there and he's pinned and he's the last one left, <laughs> it's minus three. Right. So he's, 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 there's a good chance that he would uh, fall back or run in the case of a vermin. They would definitely run. Yeah. Well, yeah. yeah. Um, okay, so you can see in that, in this kind of scenario, you don't always have to completely wipe out a unit to get rid of them. Potentially, if you can force them to do a nerve check, yeah. then they will get removed. And it's another reason to maybe, if you if you is a broken unit, you might want to fire your pinning weapons at it to make sure it's got a minus one yeah. in the end phase. Well, I can't kill it, but if I pin it, there's a good chance it could it could flee. Okay. Um, and uh, and yeah, and obviously the position of your inspiring units as well uh, is uh, is key. So another reason you might take nerve tests is maybe from uh, command abilities or abilities of units. Maybe a psychic attack, something like that, might force a nerve test. Yeah. And that might not uh, cause a unit to uh, run away. It depends what the rule is. It might cause them to be pinned or it might cause them to fall back or, or something like that. Um, but, you know, in inspiring, it's any nerve test is a reroll. Um, but it could be that, um, yeah, as I say, you, you might have a, a command ability which forces a, a nerve test on, yeah. a, on another unit. Now, command units are, are quite unique in that they never have to take command uh, in the end phase. Never have to take those nerve tests for being broken. Right. They lead from the front. They have iron will. Yeah. So a, a, even a broken command unit will never have to take a nerve test in the end phase. But they might still have to take nerve tests for other abilities or, or things like that. Yeah. So these, say for example, this unit here, because he's got his bodyguards within. Yeah. So once he'd lost, it's below fifty percent. Remember. Yeah. So if he'd lost his two bodyguards, he's now broken. Yeah. But because he's a command unit, he doesn't have to take that end phase test to to flee. Okay. Cool. So there you go. In this video, you've seen how nerve checks work.